This is First Alert Weather. Well, you know, it's picture perfect out. Mm -hmm. It's like you look up a picture perfect day in the dictionary and it is this Wednesday. But summer's not completely gone, it sounds True. like. And when oh, you're talking. Kelly. <laughs> and also, I got to. Well, talk we don't want to get too used to it. And Laura, when you say picture perfect, Am I included or should I yes, step out? Yes, no, stay in the course. picture, oh, Brian. Okay, just making sure, <laughs> just want to make sure of that. Picture perfect weather, I'll go with that. It is gorgeous, not a cloud in the sky. No smoke to be seen from the fires out west. Not much of a breeze. I really don't think you can improve on weather like this. Present company included. Thank you, Laura. 71 degrees, low humidity, only 34%. Northwest breeze at nine miles an hour. So as I say, grilling, do it yourself if you wish. Go to one of our establishments, keep them in business as well. It is going to look very nice for evening. 70, Trenton, 72, Chillicothe, Leavenworth, 71 degrees. Still some 70s, middle 70s the farther south and west you go. Warmer out over the Plain states, but still relatively cool in the Show Me State. 70 on the nose in Warrensburg, 72 in Sedalia, 73 in Butler. Here's a look at first alert clouds and radar. Remember I showed you the rain that's happening in Cleveland, which has postponed the game between the Indians and the Royals. And here's the back edge of some of that cloudiness in the cumulus field over Illinois and Indiana, but it's moving away which is why if we look out west on the western horizon, as Johnny was talking about, it is crystal clear and it will be that way for the duration of the evening hours. Evening forecast, hour by hour, 70 degrees by 6 p.m. Winds will go northwesterly at about 8 to 15 miles an hour, but look at how quickly we drop to 65 by 8 o'clock, partially because the days are getting shorter, we know that. Sun angle is getting lower, so it's not high in the sky anymore. It's kind of hovering closer to the ground, if you will. 59 by 10 o'clock and by midnight we will be at 56 degrees and continuing to fall down. Low temperatures, I like to keep that phrase up there. Sweater weather once again, as our lows will be down into the 40s, much like they were this morning. 44 Maryville, 46 in Trenton, Leavenworth also, 46 Lawrence the same, Ottawa also 46. But then as you get closer to the city, Upper 40s, close to 50 degrees, but nobody's going to be touching 50, at least tomorrow morning, with that north wind at about 5 miles an hour. 12-hour forecast, first full day of fall, 49 in the morning, but 66 by 11 o'clock. Noontime temperature, very close to the 70s and staying there, and not really going too far up that scale at all. Middle 70s for a high, winds westerly at around 10 miles per hour. Looking pretty nice, but there's going to be another front that moves through. It's going to be a 50-50 weekend as far as the seasons are concerned, because we're going to go back into the 80s and the humidity will start to tag along as well. But enjoy tomorrow, still feeling like fall. And then the mornings start to warm up a little bit too. 57 to 81 degrees on Friday, Saturday 51 to 80. Sunday for Sporting and Chiefs, feeling like summer. 58 in the morning, afternoon high of 88 degrees, close to 90 on Monday, and we don't really drop much at all. We're going to stay in the 80s from Tuesday through Friday of next week, and the morning temperatures also rising from the 40s. I'm talking about tomorrow morning to the 50s and 60s by the tail end to next week.